Okay, gain rewards based on score. What's he talking about? <clears throat> Leaving something in my house. A memory with her. Clover. Little Peggy. Could it be? Hmm. Okay. What do you know about little Peggy? Blonde, blue eyes, and a mole by her eye. It's two moles. Did she smell of the same soap, too? Just how much do you know? Everything. You huh. told me all of it what? yourself, Mr. Young. What the hell? You're overlaying your memories of little Peggy onto Olivia, aren't you? Huh? This is weird. Alright, what's the identity of the giant? Yeah, who is he? Just... who are you? It was a snowy night. I remember it very well. Is Amanda doing Amanda? Okay. How's you know about Amanda? Jeez. Amanda? You know her too? Her well being is a good thing. A good indication of your own well-being, Mr. Young. Okay. I guess that's it. We got everything out of him. What on earth? I don't know what's going on in this game anymore. We already sat here, right? Yeah, we did. Okay, we gotta talk to the flight attendant now. You know what, though? I kinda wanna see. He said if you go home, there's a new clue. I wanna see what he's talking about, right? I wanna go back home and see what this new memory is. Crap. Also, I could I could change my outfit and see if uh <gasps> see if I can get any points style points with what's his name. Look, they're both still here. There was something in there. There's something here. There. A thousand bonus. Damn, that's huge. Peggy's letter three. Aha. To David, are you happy? Am I still at your side? Am I smiling like I am right now? Maybe, no, I know you definitely. You'll get bored and stop reading this long before the end, but still, I want to cut the moment of happiness and leave it for the, to the future you. Okay, this is a day worth commemorating, of course, but as this is my first letter, I'm also not sure what else to say. Still, I'm sending this letter to Mark today, and I'll send more in the future. I'm so happy. It's all like a dream. I can't believe we're boyfriend and girlfriend starting today. I will never forget this moment. She wrote that back in 2002. Huh.
Alright, I wonder if that was the new memory they were talking about or not. for this right now. Damn it! Oh, at some point maybe he needs to do that, but not now. Another Peggy letter. Look at this. <clears throat> this is November 2nd, 2002. Congratulations. Today's match was perfection itself. When you made the final long shot, I felt like I was standing still. Do you remember the first time we met? You lost the match and stayed out on the ice alone, practicing shooting over and over. Ah, so he's a hockey player. My curious got the better of me, and I called out, the match is over. You shouted back, I don't blame myself for the mistakes I've made in the past. I'm practicing for tomorrow. When I saw your face looking into the tomorrow, I thought maybe I was already in love. The team won thanks to you. It was obvious. You looked wonderful. Let me say it again. Congratulations. You were shining so brightly today, David. Okay. You change my outfit. What? Olivia Jones has a new outfit? Domestic flight and international flight uniform. Look. Ah. Change my outfit and see if I get any style points with Duncan. Immature magician shirt. Tiffy likes the immature magician outfit. Plus 10. Minus 1 to vision. Me the Mexican beard. Let's give him the Mexican beard. <laughs> oh my god. Stubble and a big mustache. Mexican beard. What, ex what the heck? I hope that... Uh, I hope that Duncan likes this. <laughs> 